all right here we are on the tipper so we'll go over here and unload this one and uh, we are doing two different fields uh, this one is oats and that that one over there is wheat and uh, we're not laying down any straw um, but I think I said something about it last week about po potentially doing that so that we can maybe start doing cows all right let's get the harvester going and uh, we're gonna hire my friend Jabak for this one as soon as he finishes unloading there he goes good job buddy and let's see hire the worker it should pipe in as far as I know okay let me get back over and get the other one my iPads are making weird noises in the background <laughs> all right so we are at 32 percent so we should definitely be able to handle both of these guys with no problem Did I just see what I saw? Was I laying down the swath over there? Maybe. <laughs> uh, well, I guess we're going to do it anyway. I guess that's the default setting. Uh, I'll have to see on this one when I hire Tipsy Drifter. Tipsy, go to town. You gonna start laying down the swath? No. Nope. All right. So it didn't change. Okay, that's good. Let's get this over to the silos and uh, offload it. Sixty-four percent, but they're gonna get full at the same time again. So there's no reason to try and put any more in there by the way the guy finally did his field his uh, cotton field so that's good to know Let's put this up in here and then while we're doing that Let's go ahead and run over to the bank and make a payment. 740000 repay it. So $735,000 in debt. Great news. <laughs> uh, so you guys are looking forward to... Uh, the new Farm Sim 22 coming out? I know I am. I'm purposely trying to stay away from videos though because I want the reaction to be genuine on my part. I mean, I know a little bit about it. I know that it's coming out on September 22nd, 2021. And uh, so yeah, that's good. All right, both of those guys are working. Let me go get my four by four. Hello everybody and welcome back to Farm Sim Friday with me, the Great Gamer. And uh, we are in the process of uh, harvesting this field. And uh, this harvester is full. I think the other one is as well. Yep. Both of them are full, so I need to get on my tippers 
and then I'll get my guys organized and we'll get going. And uh, let's move this bad boy uh, back to the farm. I don't know why I keep it over there, but you know, reasons, I guess. I think there's a gate over here still open. Yeah, there it is. So, it's pretty good. I think we only have the cat. Whoa! I think we only have the cows over here. Um, as far as that goes. But, uh, I think we might start on those soon. It involves a lot more equipment, though, so I'm not sure. Not sure about that. What do we want to do today? Ride along? Let's ride along with Chewbacca for a little bit. I guess I could theoretically fire up the cultivator and have him start cultivating do a little in cab with my friend Jabak and uh, see how we're doing. Wow, he's already up to 64%. So he's filling up pretty good. It's going to be a couple more weeks before we get done because we got this field and then we got that field over there. So. Yeah. All right, let me get, jump over to my other cultivator. There we go. And let's go ahead and start some cultivation on the field. I'm going to go over here, and I'm going to run this myself. And, uh, We'll start on this edge right here. All right, all right, all right. They're gonna fill up, but like I said, they're gonna fill up about the same time. So, keep an eye on that and uh, and load them as needed. Are you going straight, Gray? Might need to hire somebody, buddy. Here, let's hire Phoenixon. <laughs> Phoenixon, help me out, brother. I'm going to take over when he gets... I always say Phoenixon and then it turns out to be a lady. <laughs> Sorry for the accident. Uh, I'm going to go down the head row and get that straw cultivated in. And then uh, we'll turn him loose up and down here. That should theoretically work. I don't know. I might have to make a Another pass where uh, where we want him to stop at, um, so he didn't go into the other field that hasn't been harvested yet, or the other part. That's what I'm thinking. Yeah. All right. All right. The tractor or the harvester is full. And uh, we're missing the hay all together. <laughs> so, yeah. There we go. We got a little bit of it anyway. I'm going to uh, turn them around and send them back. 
this other direction before we unload the harvesters. But yeah, we want to buy some more property, but as you can see, our monies are going down. So what I'm hoping and my plan is that we uh, stockpile the oats and the wheat and then we can are you going to get out of the wheat field buddy? <laughs> uh, then we can uh, sell it all at once and uh, make a big profit and then use that profit to uh, buy more property all right he's going good he's get, he's getting a little bit of the wheat or a little bit of the oats but it doesn't look like he's harvesting any of it it looks like he's just running over it so all right let's tab over and let's head on out we got both guys ready again so we're staying busy we're staying busy, that's for sure. By the way, uh, Farm Sim Friday, it's 4.15 in the morning, real time. <laughs> so the Great Gamer is up like a farmer. And uh, get the recording made and then do the edit and all that and uh, get it up for today. Uh, a couple weeks ago, I, I did the same thing and for whatever reason, uh, YouTube took forever to process it and the video didn't even actually go up until 2 in the morning so it went up at 2 on Saturday instead of Friday I had no control over that at all alright Tipsy go to town buddy we'll come over here and we'll get uh oh uh oh stop the tractor Stop the tractor. Stop the tractor. You're cultivating my harvest. <laughs> That's not necessarily your fault. I get it. I get it. Wait a minute, what, am, what am I doing? I just should just take him down here and let him do this side. Ah, <laughs> we need that profit. All right, let's see if we can do this without tearing up too much. I do want to get that larger cultivator next time, though. The one we used a few weeks ago for doing a uh, pay job. Because... That would really make it easier on this field, but if I remember right, the horsepower we needed was like off the chain. Okay, back to the tipper. All right, let's move out. Time is of the essence. You also got to keep an eye on where that guy's going because he might cut across the other part of the harvest if I'm not careful. Let's back that up a little bit, Gray. Okay, so it's okay. He can go all the way down to the end because I did make a head row all the way around, so that's okay. All the notes. Wasn't that a group back in the day? <laughs> Singing group, yeah. Hauling oats. And I'm hauling oats. Good job, Gray. Alright, you can cut through this gate and try to make your way around to the silo again at 64 percent yeah 
and uh, I don't know how much we got in there, but. It should be quite a bit once it's all said and done. We should be sitting pretty good. All right, all right, all right. Like I said, I haven't been keeping track on the new game coming out, but I do know that there's three new crops and there's a built-in weather system and there's two new maps and uh, there is one thing that's confusing to me and that is you can buy the game directly from giant and you get a with the collector's edition you get a beacon and the beacon uses a USB plugs in on your I mean it's a li little legitimate beacon uh, but my thing is, is that, uh, okay, so usually I get it through Steam, right? And Steam keeps the game updated. So my question is, if you buy the, the version, the, the collector's edition, um, which is not compatible with Steam, it says, then the question becomes, well, how do you update your game? Maybe you guys know. Maybe it's a... Maybe it's a thing. Um, is he plowing crop again? Nope. <laughs> Not yet. Good job. Well, we're doing pretty good. This harvest, this cultivator is super slow though. I mean, you don't get very much done. And that's a big field there. And this is a big field here. So maybe sell. Uh, let's see, I've got three tractors. Sell three, sell two of them. And, uh, and then buy the bigger one. I mean, the 500 horsepower one. I'm thinking if I, it almost would take every bit I got to do that. Because um, I don't know how much I'd get for these because they have been used. I mean, these two Fiats. By the way, if I'm not saying that right, let me know. This is a Fiat, right? Yeah. Might not be pronouncing it right, but whoa. Let me go over here and uh, cut a. Well, wow, they're almost full again. I'm going to go down here and cut a line across here. plow line, cultivate line, whatever you want to call it. And uh, that way he doesn't continue straight across into that other section. I mean, I don't think he would do it, but we've seen him do stranger things. <laughs> uh, all right. Let's back it up right here, Gray. There we go. And lower this down. And hire the worker. Now, let's see if he can get past the... Uh, the tanks down here. Don't know. See, like, right now, I think I'm leasing that uh, cedar. And so the question is, why am I holding on to it? Let me check. Well, let me double check to make sure he gets past this tanker. 
There he goes. He's going to be all right. Yeah. Well, okay. No, he's not. <laughs> he spoke too early, Gray. All right. Let's lower that down. And we'll fudge it over just a little bit. Okay, why is the cultivator not working? Turn on cultivator. Okay. There we go. Swerving all over the place, Gray. Not the best placement for stuff. <laughs> I will admit. I will admit. All right. Um, lift that back up. And we're going to turn around and head back down to the other side of this field. Excuse me with the leaves. <laughs> uh, now I'm going to cut across. The idea being I'm going to cut across, straight across. Um, I don't know. I might have bought the cedar. I'm going to have to look. All right. That guy is ready to go. So let me get right here. Hire the worker. Go to town for Nixon. And uh, let's head on out. Unload these guys again. I'll come around behind him this time. Behind that guy anyway. <laughs> And uh, we're not going to get very far in this episode, guys. I mean, I feel like I'm getting stuff done and I'm staying on top of it for the most part. But I guess that's farming life for you. Um, but the other one should, yeah, he's full too. And he doesn't have much left, but that's only about half, and we've already emptied him twice. So I don't know what to say on that deal. All right, now he's going to turn around, and he's going to go back down. Now the question is, which side of the row is he going to be working on? <laughs> uh, all right. All right, he's getting going closer to the unharvested side but that's okay there's room there for him I'm gonna cut in front of him this time oh this guy's still going I thought he was I thought he was full but not yet I think I got the message that he was at 80 percent though so he's going to be full whip it there he goes got another load for the silo but I'm gonna have to let you guys go we're already out of time on the episode so thank you guys for stopping by and checking me out I do appreciate it very much and uh, if you like the video consider giving it a thumbs up if you haven't subscribed uh, consider doing that and uh, then you'll know uh, hit that bell notification and you'll know when I post up again. Take care, everybody, and we'll see you next time. Get over there and stop him. Okay, yes, you got room. Are you going to get there before he gets there? You guys are playing chicken with each other? What's going on? You're going to get there at the same time? Who's going to stop? Oh, look at that, look at that. Close. <laughs>